There's nothing like soup. It's eccentric by nature. No two are alike. Unless of course you get your soup in a can. So today I'm going to show you how to make a bowl of piping hot broccoli soup. For that, I have one potato diced, one onion chopped, one clove of garlic that I've just cut into half, two cups of water, salt. Let's boil all these ingredients for 10 minutes. Ten minutes are up, and now into this, let's add two hundred grams of broccoli florets. Give this a stir, and if you feel the need to add a little more water, add some, and let this cook for another four to five minutes. Five minutes are up, and let's check on the vegetables if they are cooked. The potatoes have nicely softened, and the broccoli is cooked as well. Let's turn off the flame, and I'm going to bring this pot off the flame and let this cool down for at least 10 to 15 minutes. While this is cooling down, I'm going to quickly make the white sauce, for which in the saucepan. I'm going to add one cup milk, one tablespoon of corn flour, one teaspoon of butter, and now turn on the flame. Keep stirring on this continuously because as the milk thickens, it's going to start sticking to the saucepan. The milk has started to thicken. And now, just keep stirring it for another two minutes. Turn off the flame. And now, these vegetables have slightly cooled down. I'm going to grind them into a smooth puree with this hand blender. Grind this into a smooth puree and make sure there are no potato pieces left behind. And now very carefully, I'm going to mix this broccoli stock with this white sauce. So into the saucepan, let's pour this. Mix it well and bring it to a boil. I'm also going to check on the salt since I've added some earlier. just need a little bit and this soup is ready to plate. I'm going to pour this soup into this bowl. Let's garnish this soup with a few strands of cheese a few broccoli florets and I'm also going to drizzle some garlic infused olive oil. I've just heated a little bit of olive oil and sauteed one clove of garlic in it. There is nothing more satisfying than a bowl of hot soup after a hard day of work. Do try this at home, comment below and let me know how it turned out. And also, don't forget to subscribe to Rajri Food. See you next time. Bye-bye.